so I'm probably really late on this whole thing, but I don't think better late than never. Honestly, I've been reading a lot of hate all over Facebook, all over Instagram, everywhere. I mean, honestly, this election, yes, I said election, ah, uh, politics. I'm really not a political person, political, but this needs to be said. This election was like handing us two candidates saying, you want the left Twix, the right Twix? Do you want the conniving liar or the person that has no background in politics? But, you know, let's just be honest here. Trump's president. Trump is our new president, and he's going to be our president for four years. So we can either band together as a nation and support him, whether you voted for him or not, whether you hate him or not, whether you believe he's going to do the right thing, whether you think he's going to fuck up. We are one nation. We are the United States of America. And you know, all the hate and disbelief and bigotry and whatever else you want to throw, whatever else, what other negative words you want to throw in there, that's what's going on right now. And if we don't band together and get behind Trump, then we're even weaker as a country. So put aside your hate and this Christmas or Hanukkah, whatever religion you are, I don't care if you're Islamic, I don't care if you're celebrating Kwanzaa, pray for Trump. Pray that he does the right thing. Pray for yourself. Pray for your family. Stop all the hate and just live. Love is better than hate always. So pray for Trump. Pray Pray for our country. Pray for our veterans. Pray for those who need it. If you hate someone, the best thing you can do is pray for them. That's all I have to say today.